we have here is the an orb blasting off the surface of the sun. Um, you can see it moving and various strands feed into the orb. This was seen in the 16th century by a newspaper reporter, um, Hans Glazier. The woodcut of the 16th century um, remains in the Zurich Library. I purchased it and the transcripts I got um, translated into English. So obviously these orbs came from the direction of the sun and the orb research I've done. This um, backs up everything that I've seen in the woodcut. Uh, what we have here is uh, a reverse of the orb blasting off the sun. You can see it slowly moving towards the sun and the strands attach into the st sun which feed in the energy to the orb. I don't cover any of the consciousness about it because that's just speculation. But what you can see is the strand feeding the orb. It's unfortunate that the helio viewer is taken offline when anything interesting goes on. And that occurred when the Banda Achi um, event, or tsunami, or whatever you want to call it, uh, when this all blasts off the surface, has spin and charge, and is attracted to one of the poles and pulled into the core, and it causes geological problems. And thus, we have I think it was 300,000 deaths caused, and I, I truly believe that the um, people in control of, of this Helio viewer are responsible well, for the censorship and what is um, ultimately the deaths because if they shared this properly we could formulate new uh, ways of looking at the universe. Unfortunately, it's not going to happen. Um, all these professors with tenure are not going to step aside. So this is a close-up of the orbs forming. Although, you know, it's not very clear because I said the censorship goes on but it's blasting off the surface of the sun. And when it's got spin and it's got charge, it'll get pulled to the poles. This is uh, part of the woodcut, which has been altered by the library. Well, in the center of the orb, it has a dot in it, or the hole, and that matches our data, which is the photograph alongside the cartoon image and um, as you see in the bottom corner the orbs falling out of the tubes which they do and that uh, led us to the um, orb fugalite theory <coughs> in which dust sticks to the charge of the orb and falls from the surface from the sky and you can see the steam coming out so this um, event occurs 
So I've just added some backup uh, information. This is uh, a Scandinavian rock art, which has been painted by the students. It's four and a half thousand years old, and it's con some of it's contained within the book we wrote in 2004. Thank you very much. Goodbye.